was the first. I think today is really a historic day for the state of New Jersey. It's a momentous day, uh, thanks to the Senate President and my colleagues that we've released a bill to legalize marijuana for all individuals over the age of 21. Uh, I think the travesty of justice that's been going on for the past 100 years is the sea change is starting to correct itself. And, uh, and we look forward to passing through the bill on this full Senate and Assembly floor. How about the social justice aspect? A lot of questions, a lot of back and forth about that. Is this going to move the social justice aspect? Well, absolutely. I mean, uh, we, have, we have social injustice right now going on. We have people that are minorities that are three times as likely as whites being arrested for marijuana possession charges right now. So we've got to res we've got to resolve that. But the other social aspect of it is that certain people in certain disaffected or affected areas by the drug world have an opportunity or a greater opportunity in the scoring system to get retail sales. And we actually have a second bill on social justice. The Senator Cunningham, you haven't heard yet, but we'll be hearing soon, that allows any any criminal record that's expungeable today to be automatically expunged over a 10-year period. So it's not just the marijuana, we've gone beyond that for social justice. It's a package of three bills, an expansion so, of the Medicaid. Well, that's, that's what it is now. So but, be, but automatically you would be able to sponge You wouldn't have to hire lawyers and go through the expense. It would be a much more seamless, more, more efficient process. So you have three bills today. You have the adult use, medical that you haven't heard here yet, and you heard the, uh, the, the social justice piece, which is Senator Cunningham's bill. They're all packaged together to move together. Senator, so, there's people that bring up the idea that uh, the expungement is not going to be possible technologically. It's not true. It's not true and realize something. The court said that they needed so much money to create the process online. And obviously, since it's such a big piece, we're going to ensure the funding's there to create that. And, you know, again, it's 10 years from the passage of the law. Technology evolves pretty quick. Yeah, well, I mean, first of all, the, the adult use bill allows for automatic expungement of simple possession charges. That's the aspect of that part of the bill, which is already expungeable now, but after a waiting period. Once this bill is signed, you'll be able to apply for expungement of possession charges immediately. So you won't have to wait the 10 years. The 10 years that the Senate President is speaking about is for people that are multiple offenders that perhaps are no longer eligible or ineligible for expungement now. That's a more expansive piece of legislation that's not encompassed in the legislation that I just passed. It's 144 pages already. So now